Why are sunsets red? Why is the sky blue? Well, it all starts with the composition of our atmosphere. And our atmosphere scatters light proportional to the frequency to the fourth power. Well, since blue has a large frequency, blue scatters a lot. Comparatively, red has a much smaller frequency than blue, and since it's to the fourth power, this scattering is a big effect, red therefore scatters a little. And green is in between. Excellent. So, Let's, let's think about this a bit. Let's start with the sun. So here's our sun. And over here is Earth. And here you are, so it's high noon. Obviously, th things are not drawn to scale here. By the way, how do I know it's high noon for you at this position here? Well, I know that because if you look straight up, you see the sun. So therefore, that's the position on Earth where the sun is high noon. Let me just redraw things here because I'll need that. Okay. Now, let's draw atmosphere around you. In fact, to make things look a little more realistic, let's draw you a little bit smaller. So here's you. There. That little dot there. <laughs> so let's draw the atmosphere around Earth. So this is the, the atmosphere. And then this is the planet Earth right here with the big E. Now, let's take them one at a time. So first, let's, get, let's talk about blue light. Blue light has a uh, high frequency and therefore a small wavelength. Because it has a high frequency, it will start, it scatters a lot in our atmosphere. And most of the blue light has already been scattered out by the time it reaches us. Now let's consider green light. Green light has a slightly longer wavelength than blue. And it's in the middle, so it does scatter, but, you know, not a lot. And now let's consider red light with its long wavelength. And due to its long wavelength and small frequency, it doesn't scatter very much at all in our atmosphere. And therefore, what reaches us? Well, we see, we see red plus green, which equals yellow. That's what reaches us through the atmosphere, and that's why our sun is yellow. Notice also that the blue light scatters quite a lot. Recall, it's to the fourth power, so the, the difference in frequency has a big effect. Well, because the blue light is scattering out, when we look away from the sun, we see blue, because most of the light that's scattered is blue, so it dominates. So when you look away from the sun, you see blue. So that's why the sky is blue. Now let's consider sunset. So at the time of sunset, here's the sun, here's earth. At the time of sunset, you are here. How do I know that? Well, if you look along the horizon, that is a long earth, you'll see the sun. And that's what you see at sunset. Let's draw atmosphere. And right off the bat, I want you to notice something. I want you to notice that the distance between the surface of Earth and the top of the atmosphere at high noon is this. But at sunset, you're traveling farther. It's like you're taking the diagonal. So notice that the distance at sunset through the atmosphere is much larger. 
Great. Let me uh, get rid of these so we can draw our colors. So let's first take blue. So here's our high frequency blue light coming through. And it scatters quite a lot because it goes into the fourth power. And it's, it's all scattered out in the upper atmosphere. Pretty much. Green light, lower frequency, longer, wave, uh, longer wavelength. Doesn't scatter as much as blue but does scatter more than red, and due to the extra distance that the light is going, well, all the green light has been scattered out as well. Red, with the longest wavelength, is the one that reaches, it does scatter, but not as much as these guys. This is the one that reaches us, and the one that still has stuff left over to scatter in the lower atmosphere. Well, that's why at sunset, the sky is red. I mean, I should say red-ish, right? Because there's still some green and blue light that makes it through, especially with the green. And that's why you get that sort of orangish hue. All right. So now we know why at sunset, the sky is red. During the middle of the day, the sky is blue and the sun yellow.